Hi everyone at Praise Chapel Revival Oxnard. This is Pastor Johnny Montillo here to bring you a daily devotion that I hope and I pray encourages you, motivates you, draws you into deeper intimacy with the Lord and allows you to get deeper into your word. Today I wanted to talk to you about fighting past procrastination. Oftentimes we can be people of procrastination or people of stagnation when it comes to being in our word, being in prayer, and then being in our worship. And when this happens, when we become procrastinating people or procrastinating individuals, what happens in a sense is that it begins to set forth a chain of events where we just become familiar with procrastination and stagnation and next thing you know we haven't prayed in a few days we haven't read our word in a few days or we haven't worshiped in a few days and and then our spiritual progress takes a hit in the book of ecclesiastes chapter 11 verse 4 it says whoever watches the wind will not plant whoever looks at the clouds will not reap so those distractions that we can have at times when our head's in the clouds or, or, or we're not paying attention to or being rather disciplined and, and reading our word and getting into worship, what can happen is we can become fully stagnant and then we can find ourselves in a place where now we have to get re-disciplined and, and, and have our progress re-established. A couple of ways that we can get through procrastination is first and foremost to realize that we are procrastinating. We can't be blind to the fact that we are procrastinating at times when when we fail to read our word daily or we fail to be in prayer it should creating us a godly conviction that reminds us that man we need to get back into the word we need to get back into prayer and another way we can fight through procrastination is to get rid of those distractions as that verse said in ecclesiastes whoever whoever watches the wind will not plant and whoever looks at the clouds will not reap if you're being distracted by these minor things uh, of the day or are in life they'll take you away from the most important spiritual things of prayer worship and being in your word so with that being said fight through procrastination and fight for spiritual progression as always keep your eyes focused on the lord and let the holy spirit infill you in a mighty way